Yo, what is up, everybody? Oh my goodness, I do not want to buy any of that. <laughs> uh, let me go here real quick. Let me get rid of some of this here. For basics, trying to get that stuff out of the way. I have officially 100% completed Act 4. My units should be a little bit higher, but I'm trying to gain on that. My goal is to get roughly... Eh, like roughly... What, what's that? Oh, I'm fake tickets, okay. My goal is to roughly get at least 10,000 by the end of the year to banquet. So I'm going to try and save as much as I possibly can. I think it's going to happen. I'm uh, not really sure I got to do uh, acting. I uh, not only acts, but different things. But yeah, I 100% completed the act full. Because by the time that you saw me do this, I think I just um completed act four. Um, but today I just because my so I'm still up in Pennsylvania, so I'm sorry for the lack of uploads because of that. So that's why I'm trying to get uh, this video out to you guys today. But um. But I was trying to grind and trying to go on 100% before Act 4. Now, I could have done this sooner, but I am doing. I did it now because, well, I tried to finish as much as I can last night. Now, I just want to give you all guys... Now, also, I am I am uncollected. Let me show you guys that. I am uncollected. Um, because I'm on Chapter 3 right now. Because I was trying to gain units while Banquet was going on. But I, I am uncollected as of right now. I'm gonna try and do Act Five while I can. But I have stuff with these back issues to go on and do first, because these classic ones. And my goal is to 100% complete the um, classic stuff, and then to go on and 100% complete the variants. Because the variants. I mean, of course, you can get, like, that stuff, like, six-star shards and whatever, whatever, but I want to wait a little while to, um, to do that. Uh, so, I'm gonna go on. I think I'm, yeah, I just got 100% complete this go on to Blood and Venom. Then I'm gonna go back and 100% explore, um, this stuff as well. So... That should be fun, but guys, um, as you guys should know that this is going to be a crystal opening, um, so I do, I can get at least two different five-star shards and five-star crystals, because as much as I want to do a five-star featured, which I've never done, um, I'm going to, wait, it's a five-star. I'm gonna try and do see where the final just came in, so I'm gonna try and do two of these, two angles just to try and do that. But um, yeah, it's just I just got stuff to do. I'm gonna save the nexuses for last, of course. Um, the five star awakening gem, which would be great if I get tech, because I'm gonna try and awaken my five star king conqueror. And you just go on from there. First off, I have nine of these. But I'm gonna try and pop most of these up because this video is gonna take a while, except for these things. Um, which I'm gonna spin out. But this other stuff, okay, so I can do it. This other stuff, I'm just gonna try and pop it up because I have over 100 crystals to go on and do. Um, this stuff, yeah, no, I don't really worry about that. Um, tier three. Yeah, I have come to my senses I don't really use tier 3 a lot anymore because I'm doing like 6 stars and 5 star champions. Like 4 stars I kind of, like 2, 3, and 4 stars I try and do um, as much as I can for like arena battles, but that's that's pretty much it. Um, I'm gonna spin out the five star. Hopefully, it's a tech. Like I said, if it's not a tech, then I'm not really worried about it. I mean, I'll throw it on someone, but it's mainly um, mainly five star king of the conqueror. So if we get a tech, that'd be amazing. I don't know any cosmic champions. I need it though. I, I don't really 
really know anyone because I have a two star cosmic. I don't really know any cosmic chance, so I would just guess I have to wait until I can get. Uh, that's good. Okay. Sometimes that doesn't update. Um, gonna pop open these two. Okay, that's whatever. Uh, five star, yeah, so five star, um, big stones, I got 100 of these. Hopefully, I can get, um, yeah, okay. Hopefully, I can get more mystics. Mystics and science is what I need for, like, if I got tech, I would say yes, tech absolutely, because I was, you know, King Conquer them, but, but I'm probably going to hold off on my, if I get, I'm probably am going to get some tech 5 star, um, 6 stones, but, you know, if I do that, I'm just going to hold off until King Conquer, because I have a couple days left until I, I think it's like 11 or 12 days left onto getting, um, a 5 star 6 stone from the Alliance thing, so... There's that. So I'm just gonna quickly pop these ten open. Go and do that. So no mystic, unfortunately. And the reason why I want mystic is because of my Mephisto, so he can be stronger going into Act Five. So I, like I said, I don't know who else I will be using this stuff on. Probably the Cosmics. I'll go on to Thanos, so he can become stronger. But that's pretty much it. Um, oh, there we go, I got three, so that's three more things going straight on to the fifth go. You know what, I'm just, I'm not even gonna, I'm just gonna hope for the best, um, that these camps can be stronger, of course, because all of the stuff is gonna go on to, um, all that stuff's gonna go on to them. And, oh man, my eye is still fucking itchy. I don't know why my eye is itchy. Um, final ten. There we go, guys. So let's see what I'm cooking with. I got 24 five star cosmic six stones, 13 tech six stones. I guess I'm probably gonna put them off for my five star king conqueror. I got 22 five star mutants, which I don't know who I'm gonna throw that onto yet. Um, 14 five star skills, 13 five star science, which is great for Red Hulk, and then 14 for um, Mystic, which is fantastic for Mephisto because he needs to be stronger. Like I said, I know, kind of, kind of, I know that I am kind of saying this repeat stuff. But I just want to give you guys an idea, and I just want to make sure that I say it enough where my brain knows exactly what I'm doing. So Science and Mystic are all going to go on to Red Hulk and Mephisto, because those are two of my top champions right now. And probably the 24 Cosmic is going to go straight on to Thanos. I don't really know any other Cosmic champ that I want right now. Now, my goal eventually, and I think, and this is what I'm thinking, and probably all my tech is going to go straight on to uh, King of Conqueror. So, my goal is to just work on everyone, one champion at a time, and once I get everyone to where I need them to be, then I can work through their highs. Like, I think I just need a one-star Juggernaut. Then, after I get the one-star Juggernaut, I'm going to try and make him up as much as I can. Then, I can go on and do uh then i will go on and have every one star champion except for summon symbiote i mean i do have summon symbiote but i don't have him as strong as the dragon which is shit but hopefully besides my summon symbiote i have every one star champion to their max level because they don't need awakened or anything so there's that um, but my goal is to just chuck everyone down one champ at a time and go from there until eventually, later down the line, for years to come, I have all of these champions 
to where, you know, they need to be. Um, that's fine. How many of them? I'm not worried about that. Uh, my goal for the inclusion points, by the way, guys, object is to get five remaining in six down. Uh, so I have three crystal. I do love my three crystal. I just that I'll put it in the door and So I'm now going to have to go here. Pop that open. Hooray, hooray. I'm just gonna get two of these because I don't care. Open. That's better than what I thought it was gonna be. Um, and I'm gonna move on to the shotted crystals. I'm gonna get just two regulars. Um, hopefully I get a werewolf by night. Um, because I would love a five-star werewolf by night, but I don't know how much I'm gonna get him, but my chances of getting Will by night increase just a little bit. He's got two chances of getting him. Uh, because I just don't have any, any you know, shards to get. If I had 20,000 shards, I would have, you know, gotten, I'm sorry, 30,000 shards, I would have gotten, um, yeah, I would have gotten two of those featured, which would have increased my chances even more, but still. Other than that, a 5 star Aegon would be nice. I would really, really, really appreciate a 5 star Aegon. I have a 3 star. I'm throwing 3 star 6 stones onto him, but Aegon is, uh, Aegon is the main guy. It's not him, then Venom Pool, and I do have that 5 star Cosmic Awakening gem on top of that. So if I do get a 5 star Venom Pool, I will also put that onto him. Then Venom Pool might be my next working. Cosmic Champ after Thanos. I'm gonna wait a little while to throw Sigs onto him and just wait until Thanos is completely done. Other than that, any new champion of a 5 star who I do not have would be amazing. I don't want any Duke 5 stars, just anyone new would be incredible. So the first 5 star I'm getting is a 5 star Jubilee. Do I have Jubilee? I don't remember. I do not have a 5 star Jubilee. That's good guys. I'm trying to go on and make a list of champs who I need to go on make a list of champs of who I have and like what their star, or like what their star rating is and whatever, whatever. So 5 star Jubilee is the first one. Not looking that good guys, but hopefully I do get an Aegon, a Wolf by Night, or a Venom Pool, or someone brand brand nice. So it's just always we hope for a new champion, especially for someone who I do not have. That's even better. And five star Hulkling. That's great. I don't have five star Hulkling. Um, my mom actually uses uh, a five star Hulkling, and he is a great champ. So I cannot wait to take a screenshot of that and send it to her. But um, now I know that my uh, five star Cosmic is my Cosmic Awakening gem is going to go straight onto a five star Hulkling. Now guys, this is why you keep the Nexus Crystal to last, because uh, just in case with the regular stuff, you don't know who you're going to pull, and you would want to get new champions all the time. Um, so, I have the majority of the 4 stars, but 4 star A1 or 4 star Venom Pool would be nice with just a brand new 4 star in general, I know I get to choose, but... It's either going to be Venom Pool or Aegon. I don't have a Venom Pool, and as much as I would love to get myself a full star Aegon, I'm going to try and get that Venom Pool if I can, just to say that I have Venom Pool, just so I can cross off more champions off of my list. So here we go, guys. Uh, oh, fuck me. I should have looked at it. Uh, <laughs> um, I guess the only logical... The only logical explanation is to go with um, a full star Storm Pyramid X because she's the only one that I don't have out of these three. I could awaken the Abomination, but I'm not going to, guys. I want to get my roster as high up there as I can. So I'm going to go with Storm Pyramid X. Um, I don't know how great of a champion she is. I don't really play her. I mean, I have her in, I think, like a three star form. 
but I don't normally really play as Golden Pyramid X. This might give me a reason to. I am not sure. Um, but before anything, I do want to go down here right like, before we go on to that. Um, so these are. So these are all the champs who I still need to get. Um, from Bullseye on down. These are just the all the different champions that I need to get. Um, which in hindsight, if you take out all like the brand new, new like the brand brand new ones, like White Tiger and Bullseye and whoever else, these are all the champs I need to get. So it's not that many guys. So hopefully, hopefully I get someone who I don't have. Hopefully, as much as I want a five star Aegon. Hopefully I get either a Venipole or a Werewolf by Night. Uh, hopefully I get a Werewolf by Night. Um, because he's just brand, brand new. So hopefully I do that. And if not Werewolf by Night, then maybe a Vox. Just some brand new champion. I, I just want a brand new champion. Rather it be just came out or I just don't have him. I want a brand new champion for this five star. No matter what. And trust me, I don't have a lot of the five stars. So hopefully... Oh man, I think I have all these. Ugh. This is a hard one. Oh man, I should take a better look at that. So, fun fact Daredevil's Hell Kitchen was my original guy in my other account, and um. I do believe I have a Sentinel. I'm gonna hate myself. If I don't have the Sentinel, because then my next quest is going to, you know, get a Sentinel. I know I have Colossus 100%. I guess... I guess Colossus? Colossus is a good champ, right? So I think I have Daredevil's Hell Kitchen. I want to say that my pick is Colossus. Probably, because Sentinel isn't that great. It's just I want to fill out my roster space as much as I can. This is not what I was hoping for at all. But... I'm just going to go with it. I'm going to go with it. I just hope that I picked out the right decision. Then if I... Go on, and I realize that I didn't have a daredevil or a sentinel, then I'm gonna hate myself forever. Um, let's go down here. No, oh, no, I do have both of them. Okay, that's cool, so I feel less bad now. Um,. But still, though, I was hoping I could get, you know, a brand new champ out of it, but, but still, though, guys, I think overall, that's very, very good, especially with the roster that I have as of right now. And I think that he might be one of the better pulls because Colossus can be a beast and I do have a lot of mutant ISO so hopefully that that is a good decision so so in my mind that to me that is a good decision to pick Colossus um over Sentinel and Daredevil Health Kitchen so that is good. he's gonna be actually guys he's gonna be my next um guy to use and like I said, I just have so much, um, so many different mutant isos to be thrown on to guys. So, you know, that's a good thing. But as of right now, guys, just to give you guys a heads up, my total base hero rating as of right now is 536,876. And my total number of heroes is 422. I don't know how many heroes there are, though. I think overall... So, 2 of 4, 22, but, like, that doesn't help me with how many there.
with how many of them need to be. Um, so that's alphabetically. <laughs> um, I'm just going to go here again because that's the best I can base them off of. Um, but anyways guys, that is it as of right now. I could get him to rank 3, but I'm just going to... I'm gonna hold off. I don't know. Let me know what you guys think. So I'm also kind of want to bring Kingpin up as well. Um, Mordo needs to be brought up, but I'm gonna wait until I get a um, tier one basic mutant and tier one basic cosmic. It's gonna be one of those things. Undou undoubtedly, it's gonna be one of those things because I think yeah, he's at rank. And so is Strike. So that's that. But I could also go on. I think I do like what? See, like 50, and I only have 25. So I could go on and give someone like a man thing or a gallon that because gallon. He's top chance, like most of these guys are top chance, I'm probably might give it to Quicksilver though. Um, I mean, not, yeah, I might give it to Quicksilver to do that, because by that point, he's done, he's over with, and I don't think I gotta worry about him. Uh, that's what I might do probably, or should I... I don't know, I'll wait, I'll wait, I'll think about it, I will see, um, to see who I want to awaken next. But that is going to be it for the uh, video, guys. Um, also, I guess I'm just going to go on and say, so 16 out of 422 $6. So this is my $6 roster as of right now. So, my goal is to hopefully, you know, get better to where it is. I know I have so many different champions I need to level up still, but, hey, it's a, it's a working progress. Um, but thank you guys so much for watching. That's my crystal opening on, uh, on Act 5. I'm sorry, not Act 5. Act 4, I just 100% completed it, so now it's time to go on to Act 5. But to also take a quick short break and to go on and do some other quests and hopefully get a couple more champions or just to get, I don't know, just to get extra ISOs and stuff or whatever for Act 4 heading into Act 5 and wanting to 100% complete. Thank you guys so much for watching. I will see you guys later down the line. Okay, have a nice day. Peace.